Hi, welcome to Mini Jack. Today is um, quite a special episode. I'm not at home, as you can see, I'm in my studio. Welcome. And I'm here because I need a lot of equipment. Because I'm going to demo this new Matrix mixer. I built it for my client Sim Hutchins. He's a great guy. He does experimental uh, music with bits of drone, industrial and ambient. It's kind of weird to define music with words. I will just put a, a link to, to his music in, in the description. Go check it out. And well, the, the Matrix mixer is a 8x8 Matrix, so a total of 64 uh, Matrix junctions. It's a, an active uh, mixer. Uh, it has a built-in transformer and power supply unit, so you just have to plug the plug in the power cable and turn it on and it has a gain of 2.2 this meaning that when you turn a knob all the way up what comes out is a little bit more than the double of what came in and it makes it very useful for uh, for guitar pedals and low gain electronics it's uh, distortionless, it's very clean, and you can always use it uh, halfway. You will have roughly what comes in, it's what comes out again of one, actually 1.1, but yeah, let's say like that, it's one. And it has a supplementary output, which is actually a copy of the last line, of the eight line and it has its own uh, volume knob uh, with a gain of 2.2 as well and you can use it for different things my client is going to use it uh, to rotate it in a guitar pedal for feedback work and well for, for the demo I have to say I, I had to write notes down uh, because it's not always uh, very easy to, to replicate something that, that you're doing. It's called the, the voodoo effect, as uh, Richard Devine once said in a documentary. It's when you cannot really replicate everything that you're doing with uh, analog equipment. And it's also the, the beauty of it because you, you can take notes and do the same things but maybe sometimes you turn a knob a little bit more up or two knobs a little bit more up and it changes the, the whole game. A, a, a little change can make a big change in the final result. And for that I always uh, use a paper tape to, to note what is going in and what is going out. If you really want to do a, to have a whole, whole voodoo experience you can not use it but I kind of advise it and for this demo this is my setup then I filled all the eight channels uh, in my first channel I have a big math P it's a custom big math P uh, I made it some some years ago It's basically an, an overdrive a very warm overdrive I put inside some special diodes I like very much the crunchy sound. In the second channel I have this uh, vintage uh, Ibanez graphic equalizer, it's a 10 band equalizer and I'm using it mainly for, for the bass end as you can see. On the third channel I have uh, the Boss phase shifter. On the fourth channel I have an Ibanez uh, delay on the fifth channel, I have a tube emulator uh, distortion. It's called tubulator. On my sixth uh, channel, I have a DOD juice box, which is basically a very tangy overdrive, really focused on uh, mid-high frequencies. And on my seventh channel, I have uh, the Zoom 505. is a guitar digital multi-effect. And in my 8 channel, I have this uh, Korg Electribe. I'm using it only for to, to inject 
a drum loop, you will hear it during the demo, this is the... It's just a funky drum loop. And I'm using the last line as a main output and it's going into my mixer. And uh, with the supplementary output, I rooted it into this uh, bass amplifier to have this uh, crunchy, gritty sound of a bass amplifier. Then I mic'd it and it goes back into the mixer. So basically in, in, in the main uh, mixer, I have one channel, which is uh, the direct output from the matrix mixer. Uh, the microphone, which is uh, microphoning the bass amplifier with the same sound coming from the from the matrix mixer, and then I will be adding a little bit of reverb with my Lexicon MPX 550 unit. And so what uh, you are going to hear is the direct output of this mixer uh, in my Zoom H4n recorder. Uh, well, I think I didn't forget anything. Uh, let's get to the demo.
hope you like this demo, I enjoyed it very much. I have to say I am a bit sad I'm going to to separate myself from, from this one as I am going to ship it uh, to Sim tomorrow. And uh, if you have uh, any questions, uh, feel free to get back to me down in the comments or a private message. If you want uh, information, if you want your custom matrix mixer built or anything, just uh, contact me. And well, if you liked this video, please give me a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe and stay tuned for more videos.